So this here's a dirty condenser coil on a reach-in cooler. This is after we cleaned it with New Bright. The trick is dilute the New Bright a lot. Um, this is a liquid line dryer that's has a leak. It has two leaks. This is the new liquid line dryer. This is an exhaust fan we're replacing, uh, checking for power because we're going to find the breaker to turn it off. That's a new one strapped down. <clears throat> it's anchored to the base. <clears throat> this here's a chill water fan coil on a ceiling in a kitchen, like a little storage closet. We're removing and putting a new one. The chill water lines coming through the ceiling. Can't really see, but it's going down to a thermostat. That's a new uh, fan coil on the ceiling. This is a dirty coil from a house that had a dog. The lady did have a filter, but it was too small, so a lot of dirt was bypassing the filter. This is after we cleaned it. This is a. Uh, a train unit that has a liquid line the orifice header we convert it to a TXV it's it's a two five ton circuits this here's a a brass nipple that was all corroded we grinded it down repainted it and put new a new pipe there's a dual cap with a burnt wire there's a cooling tower we had to kind of do a maintenance on clean it uh, we replaced that uh, four groove pulley on the motor. This is a condenser that we relocated and put up on a stand. This is an ice machine that we replaced. Uh, this is the new one. Uh, this is a seven and a half ton condenser that we swapped out for a kitchen. <clears throat> this here's a 30 ton uh, water cooled unit with. We replaced two 15 ton compressors on that. Uh, this here was uh, 28 uh, ceiling fans we had to take down. This is an unloader on a semi hermetic compressor. Uh, that's a new unloader, we had to replace it. So you see you got the new unloader. We cleaned off the center head to replace the gaskets. We actually replaced all three head um, with three new valve plates. They're refurbished um, valve plates. Alright, so we just got down and placed the three valve plates and an unloader on this compressor. Uh, right here, I don't know if it's going to play. Unloader and three valve plates on this compressor. Uh, now we're using the recovery machine to put the refrigerant in. That's here, it's showing the recovery machine and all the refrigerant back. And this one on the valve. We had to clean the coil and flush it all out. It was full of slime. You gotta check this out real close. That guy was by a condensing unit we were working on. Here's a, here's a supply air, like a makeup air for a restaurant. Um, this here is so, is so wrong. Somebody rebuilt the blower wheel. And the blower wheel a lot smaller than the shroud. I mean, the purpose of the shroud is it's supposed to guide the air into the blow wheel. I mean, this, this is this. I don't know. Whoever chose that blow wheel has no understanding of the whole concept here, but whatever. Just thought I'll I'll show it. I've been a little busy. I haven't been making videos, so I'm trying. I'm gonna try to put a little parts of different things together, what I've been working on. 
I was out here at night, I figured. The AC not cooling, but also I had to check this. I mean, it's it's not. Uh, you can tell the bill is newer than the than the rest of the equipment. You know, it's all rusted inside, but it's not that new. I mean, it's, it's been here for a while, but it's just something I see. So it looks oily here on the coil, but we're not really getting nothing solid with the leak detector. You got this, is a, this is a 40 ton. Uh, this is like a 40 ton uh, condenser. Uh, your condenser. I have multiple uh, issues with the uh, fan type of control, issues. not turning on one fan, another fan, one of the other circuits was wrong the refrigerator. Like switch. I didn't get much video. Couple fuses were blown. Well, I hope you like the little mix, uh, the little mix mash, whatever of videos. Got a little bit of everything in there. You had a window unit, ice machine, uh, package units, split units, cooling tower, a little bit of a few different things. <clears throat> so uh, I got more stuff on the GoPro. There's not much uh, detail in there, but um, kind of like just short clips of what I've been working on. Um, it's, it's good to be well-rounded, kind of work on a, a mix of different things. But either way, uh, that's cool. So if you like what you see or you have any questions, you could ask. Maybe I know the answer. If I do, I could send the reply. If I don't, I'll try to find the answer for you but i don't know at all so so hope you enjoyed it and you can leave a comment below and give it a thumbs up or a thumbs down